Hello, today we're going to show you how to install Video Adpro Video Central Lite but to include the installer menu for the installer so that you can program the actual Adpro itself. Once you've acquired the software from the Adpro website and unzip the file, navigate to the setup option and that will start an install wizard. We're going to run through exactly the same as my last video for the user setup installation folder you can change that if you want to or the database folder or leave them as default as I always do. The only option from the users and the installers is that the users you leave that as no so they don't get the installer menu but we're doing the video for the installers so we're going to click on yes. Click on next, confirm your network devices and just a quick run through of all the stuff that you've just looked in the install wizard. From that, it will quickly run through the installation of the program. That's come up for me because it's on Windows 8.1. The program that I've just installed is for Windows 7. But it does actually work perfectly fine, although Adpro won't support it on 8.1. I'm not going to restart it because I've already got the software installed. But if you've got anything that you need to save, now's the term because when you click on yes, it'll go through restarting your computer and you'll lose anything you've not already saved. On your desktop you will now have an icon that looks like that for the AdPro software. Double click it and that will start the program. There will be a couple of pop-up messages that come up. If you just agree on them and I'll just minimise the screen so you can see it. What will happen now is that, as in our previous videos, you'll be able to go into database, create a site, and then once you've done that, copying the details that you've already put into the AdPro, if we connect to site, just to verify that you've accepted the installer version by checking on the Yes box, once you've actually connected to your AdPro, all these options here should be in black. So you can actually get to the installer menu to allow you to download the configuration from the AdPro unit itself. If you find that you've only got a few of these, then you haven't checked the yes box. And then you'll have to go through the install again to change the option from no to yes. If for any reason you click on this connect to site and these options here are missing, then what you will find is you're running an older version of AdPro Video Central Lite on Windows 8.1. You need to get the latest software from AdPro to be able to run it on later versions of Windows. I hope that was useful to you. Thanks.